Good day everyone. Here's our math challenge for today. And here's our question. What we're going to do is to find two rational numbers to fill the boxes that are both less than 10. Meaning, a rational number that is less than 10 times another rational number that is less than 10, this will give us a product of 99. Now, if you want to try this problem, just pause this video. We have 20 seconds and timer starts now. Time's up. Now, let's answer this question together. Now, our goal in this question is to find two rational numbers to fill the boxes that are both less than 10. Before we answer this question, let me credit this question to some Blatterwick from Twitter. So, you can follow him at Blatterwick underscore sum. Now, let's answer this question. First thing to do is to think of two numbers that when we multiply, we get 99. And the basic numbers must be 9 times 11. But unfortunately, 11 is greater than 10. We want a number or rational number that is less than 10. So what we're going to do is let's multiply this 9 by a over b. And to cancel out this fraction, let's multiply this 11 by its reciprocal, which is b over a. Now take note that 9 times a over b times 11 times b over a is just 99 because we can cancel out this a and we can cancel out this b. Now the problem is this 9 times a over b must be less than 10. Also, this 11 times b over a must be also less than 10. Now let's focus on this first inequality. Now let's multiply both sides by b. And then let's divide both sides by 10. Now divide both sides by a. This will give us that 9 over 10 must be less than b over a. Now how about on the second inequality? Let's divide both sides by 11. This will give us b over a must be less than 10 over 11. Now we have two inequality in terms of b over a. So we can combine them to create a compound inequality like this. So this says that b over a must be greater than 9 over 10, but it is less than 10 over 11. So there are infinitely many b over a that is greater than 9 over 10, but less than 10 over 11. But at this point, we want at least one solution. So to do that, we will use the concept of median fraction. For further readings regarding median fraction, I will put the link on the description of this video. But at this point, let's apply the median fraction. This is easy and simple to do. So what we're going to do is to add the numerators 9 and 10. So this will give us 9 plus 10 as b. And this a is just 10 plus 11. Now 9 plus 10 is 19. And 10 plus 11 is 21. Now surprisingly, 19 over 21 is greater than 9 over 10, but less than 10 over 11. So this 19 over 21 is perfectly fit to our value of b over a. And now, at this point, since we have the value for b over a, we can now replace this b over a with 19 over 21. Also, this a over b is the reciprocal of 19 over 21 or just 21 over 19. Now take note that 9 times 21 over 19 times 11 times 19 over 21 is 99. Because we can easily see that we can cancel out this 19 and this 2, 21. Now let's simplify first. 9 times 21 over 19 will give us 189 over 19. And 11 times 19 over 21 will give us 209 over 21. Now we have two rational numbers that when we multiply, we get exactly 99. Now let's check. Let's see what is the equivalent value of 189 over 19. 
Now, using our calculator, we can see that this is approximately equal to 9.947. This is definitely less than 10. Now, how about 209 over 21? This is approximately equal to 9.952. And again, this is definitely less than 10. Therefore, one of the solution to this problem must be 189 over 19 and 209 over 21. And as always, we are done.